What's up? You're watching The Drop. I'm Cynthia Luciette. And I'm Jay Snow. So we have a very special guest in studio today. Eric Dunn, how you guys doing? Yes, you're at 2 plus million on Vine right now. 2.5. 2.5? Okay, okay, killing it. So you posted a Vine yesterday asking your followers to ask you questions, which we're going to ask you today so your 2.5 million followers can get to know you a little better. You know, we'll get his answers. Let's do it. So we're going to start with some of the easier questions. Ex Brianna asked, who's your favorite Viner to be around? Well, uh, I've hung out with a lot of Viners between Florida, Jersey, LA, and I gotta say, like, most of them are pretty chill. If I had to pick, like, a couple, I'm just gonna say, like, my best friend Chip Hawk, King Badge, Day Storm, Alpha Cat, Curtis Lepore, they're all pretty chill to be around. Yeah. You name mostly LA Viners. Yeah. So yeah. you're saying, you're basically saying the LA Viners are shutting it down. Yeah, pretty much. They're yeah. pretty cool. Okay. And then all the Viners that go to my school, FAU, you know, we do a big at Boca Raton. Quinn Martin asked, if you want a million dollars, what's the first thing you do with it? Oh man, since I don't have a car yet, I've never owned a car, I'd probably buy me a nice little Lambo or Mercedes. Just go straight to the top. Just straight, like I'm gonna spend basically all of it yeah. on, <laughs> on, on exactly, one car. Exactly, exactly, just one car. Michael Criazzo asked, do you consider yourself cool? I'd say I'm pretty cool, you know? I just uh, stepped my shoe game up recently. I used to be a lame kid though. Really? Like in high school and stuff, yeah. And so then now you're in college and you're like, you know yeah. what? Yeah, ever since Vine, you know, my life's changed a little bit, so you know, I have to look fresh now. You yeah. Know? I used yeah. to wear jean shorts every day. <laughs> it's out of style now. Claude asks, what's your favorite accent? Let's say on a girl. Australian or uh, English. I like doing Do you do any accents? Not really, I just do like impersonations. I do like Obama, Morgan Freeman. Can we hear your Morgan Freeman? I'm Morgan Freeman. Isabel Rivera said, can you mm-hmm like Brent Rivera? <laughs> mm -hmm. That was actually I tried, you know. <laughs> <laughs> There's way more bass in it than his is, but that was yeah. pretty good. That was I got like good. five years on the kid, you know? That's true. <laughs> G Plaster 207 asks, are you a cool black person or a bad black person? I'm a cool black person. What kind of question is that anyway? <laughs> what's a what's a bad black person? Well, they put emojis of police sirens. So, oh, so they're asking if I like have trouble with the cops and stuff. Yeah, I think possibly. That's why. I've never been arrested, but I do have a story. I got in a car crash once, not with another car, but with the guardrail, and I ran from the scene. So you could say I'm a felon. Come find me, Port Orange <laughs> Police. Now we're gonna do some of the Twitter questions. At John Suterboy said, what kind of lotion do you use? It was just kind of a weird question to ask, but okay. Yeah, it is, but um, it doesn't really matter to me. I use a lot of cocoa butter, obviously. I had a, a dude come up to me once. He smelled it on my arm. He's like, is that cocoa butter? I said, yes, it's cocoa <laughs> butter. What am I gonna say? Nah, I'm not wearing no lotion. Juicy Jacobs asks, what's your favorite kitchen utensil and why? Spatula, I guess. I'm a big SpongeBob fan, so, and I Me make too. a lot of pancakes. Pancakes and eggs, you need a spatula. That was a good answer. That was actually really good. My dad has something like fork. Like, I don't <laughs> know. At Chad Baker84 asks, how do you not get friend zoned? You just gotta friend zone the girl first. If you feel it coming, you gotta friend zone the girl. <laughs> but then you still end up in the friend zone, though. Yeah, but. He's thinking about reverse psychology, yeah, you know? You gotta make sure that you don't get friend zoned. Or you could just, like, if, if you're texting a girl, just like give her one word answers and she'll she'll run away with Sort of quick. ignore her a little bit. This is terrible advice. This is no, it's great advice. It works. It does work. Okay, so this is our last question. James Grachos asks, if you could take anyone off of Vine, who would it be? Throwing shots right now. Who would it be, yeah. Put on blast. It's all right though. Nash Greer. I'm coming for you. <laughs> <laughs> He's the number one Viner right now, right? Yeah, I know, which is not a good thing. I've talked to a lot of Viners, and they don't like the MagCon, like, crew, and he's, like, the leader of it. People not getting a lot of likes anymore, and the popular page isn't the same. Like, it's just the MagCon crew. People are mad because their stuff can't get on the pop page. Take down the leader. Take down the leader. Annihilate the leader. And then yeah. The so it's leader. competitive. It's not personal. I don't hate nobody on Vine. I just want to make the app better. So thanks so much for stopping Thank by. Thank you guys for having me. No, it's fun getting to know you. So what's next for you? Are you posting anything on YouTube or anything soon? Well, uh, I just finished recording a new series I'm doing on YouTube. I've been recording the past two days, finished a couple episodes. It's called Dear Jerome. You can find that on YouTube.com. It's Eric Dunn. Fridays, 8 p.m. Eastern. You can find me on Twitter, Instagram, and Vine. Vine is Eric Dunn. Twitter is Eric V. Dunn. And my Instagram is Eric V. Dunn with an underscore at the end. So make sure you guys go follow him and then also click the subscribe button and subscribe to All Def Digital. I'm Cynthia Lucia. And I'm Jay Snow. And I'm Eric Dunn. Thanks for watching. See you Monday.